Hello Sagittarius, this is your daily for the 17th or the 18th, Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you're new, welcome to the channel. And ooh, we got two. And please hit the like button, share the video, and subscribe. We have trustworthy friends. Thank you, angels, for surrounding me with people I can trust and love. And then we have balance. Thank you, angels, for bringing my life into balance. Hmm. I like it. Very Libra energy here. Let's see what messages Tarot has for my Sagittarius friends today. Sagittarius. Hmm. Nine of Swords. Nine of Wands. Ace of Swords. Hmm. Maybe some of you, you know, some of you are going through um, some tough energy right now. There's something that you are really um, worried about that I feel like some of that pressure can be relieved by like leaning on someone else, somebody that you trust, um, you know, kind of telling them how you feel, what you're going through. Um, this may have something to do with the fire sign like yourself, uh, Leo, Aries, Sag, or an um, air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy okay but there's something that i think you guys are wanting to see it's like you're having a tough time making heads or tails of something and it's like you're, you're wanting to try to figure out something there's something you want to get to the bottom of here okay Something that's really, really worrying you. Um, maybe you feel betrayed by somebody and um, you really don't know, you know, all the, um, the information surrounding that. You know, even if it happened, you know, trying to figure out, like, did this even happen? Or, you know, did they really cheat on me? Or did they really lie to me? You know, something like that. Because the Nine of Swords is basically like, you know, you're worrying yourself um, into a tizzy for nothing. Um, that is not, you know, it's not quite as bad as it may seem. Maybe some of the things that you're thinking are, you know, you know, over the top. You know, maybe you think somebody cheated on you and they really didn't. Maybe they are just very, like, um, secretive, you know. People don't, some people just don't like to share like that for whatever reason. But, I mean, there's something that you're thinking about that's, um, that's really bothering you. And I feel like you guys may need to lean on someone, you know, to, to help you kind of balance out that energy. Maybe you can bounce some ideas off of even here. Okay, move this over. Let's see why this is happening. A lot of you feel foolish around something. Um, maybe an Aries individual. There's something that you feel like this person has like gotten away with something. Um, a lot of you feel like you know you trusted them and they just completely pulled the wool over your eyes. You know just left you without a second thought or did something without a second thought to you yeah hmm now what I'm getting here different story for some of you is that some of you guys left someone and you're feeling um, you're feeling as though you left them in a spot where you know maybe you could have done it a little better um, and you kind of want to reveal the truth to them but for others of you you feel like this person didn't care about you um, like they put on that they did and because they probably have moved on very quickly even but others of you who feel like you left somebody in a tight spot um i think you're wanting to address why you left maybe you know give them some truth even here 
Yeah. I think a lot of you are feeling like, you know, this person, you know, got up very quickly. <laughs> they got up very quickly from being like feeling devastated and um, they moved on to someone else. For a lot of you, it's the way you're feeling. Let's see what the influence is here. Yeah, I think you want to like, you want to tell somebody um, what you know what you found out um so you can move on because i get the feeling that somebody probably laid a guilt trip at your door and um you're wanting to let them know what you know about what they've done so you can move on or possibly you guys move on together you know however the situation resonates for you let's see what the advice is here Hmm. I think it's a standby, whatever it is that you believe. Um, but I also feel like if some of you guys feel like this relationship is worth fighting for, um, to do that. Because there again, the nine of swords is present. So whatever it is that you're thinking that's like very, like really horrible, um, nine times out of 10, you know, there is a little truth in that, but it's not quite as bad or it's not the way that is actually, that you're actually viewing it or thinking about it currently. Okay. So my Sagittarius friends, that's what I have for you guys. Um, Aquarius is here. Uh, Aries is here. Leo's here. Any other, um, ear sign like I said before but um, that's what I have and I will be speaking with you guys soon bye now